Turkey is a gorgeous travel destination filled with beautiful beaches, archaeological wonders, historical sites, and friendly people. It is one of the main destinations for travelers looking to immerse themselves in a different culture. And it doesn't hurt that the food is so flavorful. One of the great things about visiting Turkey is that visitors can book a tour that will take them through all the hot spots. Or they can safely wander about off the beaten path. Either way, the trip will be a memorable one. Welcome to Things To Do channel. We publish new videos every day. So be sure to subscribe and don't forget to ring the bell to get notified on our latest videos. Here are 10 things to do in Turkey. Visit Ankara Castle. Ankara Castle, or Ankara Kalesi, is a fortification that remains from the early medieval era of Turkey. Though it is unknown when exactly the castle was built, it is estimated to have been established in 7th century AD and was at one point used by the Roman Empire, the Byzantine Empire, Seljuk Turks, the Crusaders, and the Ottoman Empire. Visitors can explore the castle and everything within its 43,000 square kilometers. There are many old Ankara houses within the castle grounds that display the architectural styles of different periods. The mosques on the castle grounds are also worth exploring as they are filled with stunning architectural aspects and decor. Admire Cappadocia The historical region of Cappadocia can be found in central Anatolia, Turkey. The hills and rock sites are officially a part of Jerome National Park, which is a declared UNESCO World Heritage Site. The unique cultural and historical heritage of the region, along with its exceptional natural wonders, have made it a popular tourist attraction. Visitors head there to see the unique geological features in the four cities of Cappadocia, which include Aksaray, Nevesihir, Kayseri, and Nigde. One extremely popular activity that visitors should experience when there is hot air ballooning, which gives a beautiful bird's eye view of the wonders below. Explore Aqua Vega Aquarium. Located in Ankara, Aqua Vega Aquarium is one of the largest underwater worlds in Europe. Aqua Vega houses the third largest tunnel aquarium and is a fun place for the entire family. Exhibits such as Adrenaline World, the Seashell Museum, and Jungle Corner allow visitors to explore this amazing underwater world and get up close and personal with sharks, koi fish, Napoleon fish, clownfish, and much more. Discover Adat Kirk's Mausoleum. Adat Kirk Mausoleum, or Antikabir, is a mausoleum of Mustafa Kemal Ataturk, who was the founder and first president of the Republic of Turkey. Having opened in 1953, the mausoleum is also the resting place of the second president of Turkey, Ismet Inanu. Visitors can explore the cut stone clad monument and its beautiful Turkish architecture. The marble and stone used were brought in from various parts of Turkey, and the surface reliefs reflect that period. The park that surrounds the monument, Peace Park, is a great place to spend the day as there are over 50,000 decorative plants, flowers, trees, and shrubs from over 25 countries. Basilica Cisterns, Istanbul The Basilica Cistern in Istanbul is the largest of hundreds of ancient cisterns that can be found beneath the city of Istanbul. It was built during the 6th century, during the reign of Byzantine Emperor Justinian. Visitors can rent rowboats and float through the masterpiece to explore the majestic architecture of the past and the cistern's unique attributes. Visitors can hear stories from the locals about whether the placement of Roman ruins, such as a statue of Medusa's head, were specifically placed to show power, or whether they are just randomly put together for the sake of construction. Stroll around Estergom Castle Turkish Cultural Center The Estergom Castle and Turkish Cultural Center was established in 2005 for people to experience and better understand Turkish history and culture. Found on the banks of the Danube River and within the historical Estergom Castle, the cultural center is filled with traditional Turkish art for visitors to experience. The castle and the palace were built during the Ottoman reign in Romanesque style and visitors can explore the archaeological aspects as well as the 12th century frescoes in the palace chapel. Go back in time at Gobekli Tepe. Gobekli Tepe, which translates to Potbelly Hill, is an archaeological site in Anatolia region of Turkey. The tell, 
which is an artificial mound accumulated from the refuse of people who have lived on the site for thousands of years. It is nearly 50 feet high and approximately 980 feet in diameter. It is believed that the tell had either a social or ritual nature, and the first phase dates to the pre-pottery Neolithic period. The site has a lot of history, and visitors can learn about the sanctuary from the many local tour guides. Shop at the Grand Bazaar The Grand Bazaar is one of the oldest and largest covered markets in the world. Since 1455, the market has constantly grown and now covers over 61 of Istanbul streets and has over 4,000 shops. It was listed as one of the world's most visited tourist attractions with over 91,215,000 annual visitors. And rightly so, as the Grand Bazaar is one of the most unique places in Turkey. It can take days for visitors to fully explore the thriving complex and its architectural beauty. But it's well worth it, as they'll be able to walk away with a collection of goodies. See the Hypodrome of Constantinople Previously, the Hypodrome of Constantinople was the main sporting and social center of the capital of the Byzantine Empire. Today, visitors can explore the renamed Sultan Ahmed Square and see many of the surviving original structures. Aspects of the Hypodrome include the Serpent Column, which is over 2,500 years old, and the Obelisk of Thutmos III, which was originally erected by Pharaoh Thutmos III during the 18th dynasty. Relax at Olympos Olympos, also known as Lycia, is an ancient city, the ruins of which can be seen in the town of Sirali. It is a part of Olympos Bay Daglari National Park, which also includes the ancient cities of Adairos and Vaselis. Visitors can go on guided tours to get the full experience of the historic site that dates to the 4th century BC. Certain sites include the ruins of a bathhouse and the sarcophagus of Captain Eudemus. The ruins are surrounded by a picturesque beach and the site of Yanartis, which comprises virus vents spread over an acre that spew fire due to the methane gas in the area. 